Like it or not, Tariq, uh, the, as much as we can say without piling on, the whole Aaron Rodgers situation with the Green Bay Packers. All right, so it took about a week. Um, it, it started with him being upset with the information coming out. Then it went to uh, quoting Martin Luther King Jr., which I would have never done. Then it went to Jesus, and then it went to the apology. So it was like a seven-day sort of <laughs> cycle of all of this stuff. I don't, I don't like it. I, I, the only reason why is because he basically said he was immunized earlier and he wasn't and posed as if he was immunized. And that immunized. Kind of, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not vaccinated, immunized. And, I, like and, 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 I guess mincing words, but he gave, a, he gave a layer of protection that wasn't there. And that was what he had to sort of deal with. So I'm sort of through with Aaron Rodgers. He does these little things that kind of makes himself try to look cool. If he had just taken his stance and been not vaccinated and told people, he would have gotten just as much support. The league gave him a pass. I mean, the fine there, what was it, $15,000? And the team got $300,000. They're clearly blaming the Green Bay Packers for But they need the star power. You know he's going to come back. He's probably going to play. Give this two weeks, it'll be all over with.